So obviously on a different model boat, you would have downriggers back here. Uh, most models have that. Uh, there's some maintenance there. I think we mentioned before, there's four grease circs on there. Uh, there's also a chain tensioner in the front of that. Uh, just inspect that and do that for your preventive maintenance. And then, but every unit has a Honda GX 630. Uh, we all know they're cold blooded. And, uh, but once they get, once they get running and warmed up, uh, it's a, it's an awesome piece that runs this, the hydraulics for the unit. So, uh, Brent, you got any maintenance stuff on that motor? Uh, you want to check fuel filter? Of course I do about once, a, once a season, once in the fall, once in the, in the spring. You um, replace it? I replace it. Okay. Just, just so there's no issues, no problems. Yep. Um, cause you do burn through a lot of fuel with, that goes through there in a season. Always check your throttle cables, your choke cables, exhaust, bolts, nuts. Oil changes are, are key too. I, I always change oil on that when I do my, my motor. And, and it runs half the time the motor does, but I just change it all the time when I do my motor just to keep them on the same page. Um, hoses that we were talking about chafing is a big deal in the back. You see in that back corner there? I've actually blown a hose there where it goes through the floor. Even though I do have rubber all the way around it, it just, it, everywhere it rubs, eventually it rubs through. Okay, and then lastly, just these motor mounts that are down here, it's a rubber piece, just helps with vibration. So ju just check the, the motor mounts down here, make sure that bolt is tight on the top, make sure you don't have any cracks around the aluminum piece that go down to the deck. And then if you have any, you know, any wear, extra wear or cracking on this rubber grommet in between there. So um, we do have those and uh, we can ship them out to you. Yeah, it does shake when it starts.